Hey guys, look at this nice RK one up thing someone made. Uh, if I can find out who made it, I'll make mention of it in the description. Uh, but it's a pretty cool looking theme uh, to go on your modded Retro Pi, Raspberry Pi uh, setup. Uh, it's got the RK one up logo, it's got the emulation station. And RetroPie logos there, and uh, it just does a really nice job. See that brick wall and floor, concrete floor, uh, as you scroll through your games. Now, these these particular games don't have uh, details about it, but if we pick some that do, you can see how it shows all the information. With the steel image and then the video plays. So pretty cool. So let's let's see how we get this thing installed on your box. Let's get it started. <laughs> What up YouTube it's your boy Detroit love with another video today we're gonna to do a real simple quick video and you know for me that's very difficult to do uh, we have this Street Fighter cabinet and if we hit the player one button we can go to UI settings and we can go down to theme set and right now I have showcase as the is the selected theme, but we can switch between carbon, hursty blue. Those are the only three um, things that I have on it. We're going to add the RK One Up theme, and so I have a copy of that theme over in my Dropbox. The link is in the description, and so all you have to do is click that link and download this file. So we're going to. We're gonna download this file. Look like I, of course, I already downloaded. Let's see. Right here. I'm gonna delete it. Just so we're all on the same page. All right. So, okay. So we're gonna click on download. Pretty small file, it's not going to take long. And so, if we show in folder, we can see that file 12 meg. Now, there's a bunch of different ways you can get this file over to your uh, RetroPie, but I'm going to do it from the uh, terminal screen. So, I'm going to go up to the search. I actually have the, the terminal already saved down here, but if you didn't know how to get to it, you hit the search button and you just start typing terminal hit that it'll pop up All right. so I have all the commands here that what we're gonna do so if we do it ls it shows us where we are and what's available here we see downloads is there so we're gonna change directory to downloads do it ls again and if we ls rk one up and that's it we see the file is there in that particular directory okay so now we're gonna connect to our Raspberry Pi well we're not gonna connect to it yet we're gonna copy the file first so we're gonna just copy this command here copy that There we go. All right. So it's going to take a few minutes. It's going to prompt you for the password first. Ask for the password. 
All right, you see it's moving 100% there. Now we can connect to that Pi. So your IP address is going to be different for both these two commands. But we'll just SSH over to the machine. Get your IP address before you do this. So you're going to the right machine. Uh-oh. Control, control Z. Undo that. Control V, I'll paste that. All right, so now, oh, what in the world? I did it twice. Don't we need to do it once? Log in, Raspberry. And if we do a ls, we'll, we see it in red. We have our file there. So now we just want to put this file over into the themes directory. So we're going to sudo move that file. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to move it to the themes directory. Okay. Once it's there, we're just going to change directories to that folder. Do an ls just to verify we're there and have it there. We have the zip file. Now we're just going to sudo unzip this file. You'll see it scroll through there, but you also see these Mac OS uh, files. It's like it's doing it twice. Why? I don't know. So we're just going to remove. So now you see we have the red zip file. We have the RK1UP directory, and we have that Mac OS directory. So we're going to remove the zip file. Paste. We're going to remove. Uh oh, come on, stop it. Connect to it. We're going to remove that and then we're going to remove that Mac OS one because that should not be there. All right, so now we just simply have our four themes. All right, now we just need to reboot because it will not see that directory until you reboot. All right, so we'll reboot, sudo, reboot. That's disconnected from that. The machine will take a few seconds to reboot, and then our theme will show up. So, the link is here to the file and all the commands that you need to do. So, we hit our player one button that will get us to the menu and we go down the UI settings once our intro video is done UI settings go down to theme set click over so you see RK one up then hit the back button one more time back button and there we have our RK one up theme. Pretty cool. And so the videos will start playing. I just got the sound down. So it shows the picture. It shows the art at the top. The name of the game. Pick an alpha. Well, it's showing you the platform so this is the Street Fighter collection it has the name up there Street Fighter Alpha the rankings and all the data there show the image first and then if you stay on that it will play the video so pretty cool looking thing alright guys so that's it this is probably the shortest video I can make thanks for watching if you hadn't subscribed please hit the subscribe button now hit the like button and um, share the video let people know about me okay i appreciate you guys until next time i'll see you on the web